Well, it's a good morning and it's a sunny morning and Catherine's on breaking this morning. It's not a good morning! My straighteners have packed up. You've had them years. They've died. They are old, but they were very expensive. She's just making this end look pretty this morning. Well, I can't now, can I? Because my straighteners have give up the ghost. They give up the ghost, are they? But this morning, we're making plans. I've been and had my shower. Um, Catherine spent four hours yesterday looking for somewhere. I didn't find anywhere, so I've made a plan this morning. And we're going to the home of the porter potty Yes, so I might have made this fact up, but also... It was once the most important town in England during the Anglo-Saxon period and it's about 45 minutes south from our location now. It's got a river running through it. I found a riverside park up virtually in the town. I don't know how you find these places when I spend hours looking. Because I'm a genius. <laughs> I'm a pure genius. No, I spend ages looking. Yeah. Um, hopefully we can get in there because there's not many spaces. So, um, we need to sort the van out, you need to sort your air out, I know. we need to finish doing the pots, mm -hmm. we need to fill up with water, empty the tank, empty the toilet, and then we're off to our first, well, it, not our first, but we're off to a wild camp, yep. we're, just, we're going to be wild in it now for a while, Zach. Yeah. Well, now we need to get Zach up as well. <laughs> that is probably the I'm biggest up. challenge of he's, all. He's awake, he's just not up. We need to get him I'm dragged up out as of well. bed. I'm just not out of bed, I'm <laughs> yes. just laid here. We'll just fasten you in with seat belts round one round your le legs down there and one round your head there. <laughs> what do you reckon, <laughs> Bill? Oh, I'll travel like this, Dad, I don't mind. You're a good boy, aren't you? You slept like a log gear, didn't you? Hmm? It's an absolutely gorgeous morning out here this morning. It is. Let's hope this weather continues this week because up to now on the forecast it looks like something like this today and tomorrow and then a few days of wet but we've had enough wet lately we need more of this I'm just thinking to myself, just filling up with water Catherine's just on the toilet and uh, we ain't even had a look around the you've got these little nice little pods there so uh, yeah and a load of statics and then I think it extends down there into more seem to be a lot a lot of seasonal pictures but look at the size of this tree trunk here in front it's ginormous so let's get moving so we've made it and i don't know how we got in here but we managed to get in here and this is where we're planning on stopping tonight this small car park here We've got just enough room so we don't stick out too far. We're hung over that end. But yeah, we've got the uh, Little Ooze, I think it's called, this river. And you probably guessed it by now. We're in Thetford. Right, we're heading out to have a look around Thetford, aren't we, Bill? Bill's waiting patiently up. Got his buggy oh. out. It's about a 10 minute walk down the river that way. So, oh. Zach's feeding the geese. Feeding the geese. <laughs> I landed a piece directly on one of their backs. Oh. Yeah, well, they're yeah, looking around for it like, where's my bit no, of bread gone? They knew where it went. Yeah, and uh, me and Catherine just been over there and we saw a little uh, baby, baby deer. Monk Jack deer. Is it, they call them monk jacks, I think. Little baby one, it was only the size of eight. Dinky, it was wasn't tiny, it? Mm. Just, just across there, so there's a little bridge here, so we're going to walk over that bridge and then you can follow that and then follow it all the way down the river into town or you can walk over there and uh, it looks like there's all sorts here to be honest it's so dad, the bread with us dad's army museum and everything <laughs> yeah as you can see we have to come down here and then reverse round all these branches <sighs> probably got an extra scrape or two on there now but it had plenty when we got it Uh, there's been a cormorant out here fishing, haven't they? Yeah. Who's down here? Oh. Diving in and out. But yeah, definitely going to stop here tonight. That's a place. It's on Search for Sites and Park for Nats, this one. Next to this little, little fast flowing river. And apparently, you get deer come across here. Well, like I say, we saw that little monk jack. It was literally 20 foot away, just, just yeah. around this corner here. Yeah. It went down there. Mm. 
so it would be nice if we could see some more deer oh, it would be it? lovely yeah so yeah we can cross over the river look land to the side <coughs> enough space for i believe it says 10 vans it says not ideal for big vans it's not ideal it's not you see but, i saw this park up and dismissed it because it said that but you can get a nine meter motor home in it because i've proved <laughs> it got my new jumper on today look mm. very silky it's down there at these trees yeah. wasn't it it went across here somewhere there's a guy back there and all he's got on is a pair of shorts. I'm saying to these two, no that top or anything. He's just got a pair of scrubby shorts on and a dog. And, and they're I, going, no, I can't see no one. <laughs> and I don't feel the cold and I've got a jumper on. Oh my god, he must be mad. I think he did look a bit a bit bonkers. But yeah, it's a bit shallower across here. There's like a few ducks hanging around. Geese and swans down here. So we just walked down the river today. Lovely little and, place. And uh, see how long we're going to stop for because I don't think we'll be able to see it all today. No. This is like a castle bit up there and Dad's Army Museum. Which and is only open on a Saturday, is it? Well, yeah. it looks like that way, yeah. It says open Saturday when you were on Tuesday. Tuesday, yeah. yeah. On Tuesday today. And it says open Saturday, so mm. I presume it's a weekend thing. Got a big tree down here. I'm just saying, if you come down with your paddle board, you, you ain't getting past that. Yeah, there's obviously right next to the fence, the fence panel stuck up on top of it, look. <laughs> well, I don't know where that sunshine's gone. Behind the clouds. It's lovely when we, well, ten minutes, I think it's going to be sunny again later. Near them birds up there. Tweeting away. Look at them trees there. Oh, they're pretty. They're like huge blossom trees. Mm. Aren't they? They're very pretty. Spring house as well it's called. Mm. We can hear a waterfall or something up here. Spring's house. Ah, there was an outlet. Yeah. Imagine living here, look. Sit out yeah. on your decking. Mm. Spot fishing on a nice day only problem is is risk of flooding mm, yeah <laughs> being on a place yeah, like definitely. this well, it's like an old gate up there huh. getting there's actually size of the buds on this tree here coming out Real big buds, aren't they? Mm. But you can actually just see the bottom. Probably can't pick it up it's on only camera. About a foot deep here, isn't it? Oh no, it's deeper than that. No, it's I'm looking over there, looking in the middle. Two or three foot there. But yeah, it's uh, reasonably clear. Hmm. It is to say, it's just come through that force. Somebody's give up already. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. I mean, the legs were falling off. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the good thing of having double gear. Yeah. But it gets packed down here when it's uh, summer time. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. I have my phone, we can hear jets, but we can't, we mm. can't see them. I've got a flight radar. Ah, oh, Dad's got one of this. Yeah. I don't think they'll pick them up though, because the military ones. They normally do, they normally just don't tell you where they come from or. Uh -huh. Right now, I do. Don't quite know which way we're going here, didn't we? Well, let's have a look so we go the right way. Oh, well, we're going down that way. Over that way so we look, need to be so. following the river so it's across yeah. and then down because obviously the river splits and then goes back into <laughs> one bigger river. And we've got another part of the river over there. That bit's proper flowing. It does, it goes under that house there. It's flowing well, like that. Yeah. that reminds me of a bit of Bruges, that, how that is. Yeah. It comes under underneath a bridge next to a house gosh it's coming out at some pace isn't it yes this is where the rivers meet again or oh, whether it's all the same river oh. got some good fish in there somewhere mm. Mm. there's always a gull are you going to feed us so it's all the little the great little ooze oh, okay the sun's coming out it is beautiful warming up now yeah well, not, don't think i'd need my jumper on it well that's what's going to happen now we're not needing jumpers but we have got the buggy not going to so, complain yeah we can put the jumpers in the buggy sorry Zach. just looking at what that sketch is it's a horse with a man on 
It's a horse with a man on it. I think it's a sink, isn't it? And it's got all the writing on the other side. Mm. But yeah, first time in Fetford, never been before. Nope. Dri driven through it a few times. Uh, never been before. So mm. we'll. It's like there's an old bridge down there, look. Oh, yeah. But we're alright if we fall out later. Here's a travel lodge. <laughs> travel lodge there for you, look. <laughs> what do you mean in, for me? Yeah. No, I'll stop in the travel lodge. Alright. <laughs> it, it's, near, it's nearer to uh, nearer it's to the town. Design bridge nearer to Weatherspoons, you mean? The, yeah, there is a Weatherspoon somewhere. Um, I think it's over that way, I think. Three way split bridge from the middle. Oh, yeah. So that must be up into town then. Yeah. Shame these are all boarded up. How's that? Oh. Well, look, they weren't even being held up by anything. Not the bridge. bridge bridges. Huh. We're going to go and have a look at this old bridge over here. It's getting to that time of year, look. Getting some colour. So this old bridge here, 1829 it dates. been there some years hasn't it? Yeah it has not it? 200 years? Yeah nearly. Just nearly 200 years that's been there. Mm. Private Pike isn't it? Uh, yeah it's known for his dad's army museum so obviously it must be I don't know I don't really know the history of dad's army. Yeah. Is it known for it as in Thetford? Or maybe it was filmed there? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe it was. Mm. We're rubbish at history, aren't we? Yeah. We should look it up, really. All I know is, is there's a kebab shop somewhere up here. <sighs> because the, it jumped out at me on the maps when I was looking. Honest. Yeah, you didn't, definitely didn't just search for it. No, I didn't search for it. It just came up. It must know what I like. Mm. But there is a pretty church just here, look. Yeah. Look at that big pretty church. And there's a man up here in gold. Did you see that man up there, Zach? Mm. He's in gold. He's not looking what he next to look. The Bell Hotel. Dating from 1490? Yeah. 1490. It was a coaching in on the London to Norwich Road. It's building here, look. Note that the iron works hammered into the corner post of the hotel. And Note the iron nails hammered into the corner post of the hotel. Public proclamations were displayed here. So Zach was right. Most of Dad's but army was filmed it. Most of the external footage for the series was filmed in and around the town of Thetford. Each summer the cast and crew would come up to the town and stay in either the Bell or the Anchor Hotel. This oh, is Bell. The bell. This is and the Bell, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, the Bell Inn. Yeah. And the Bell Hotel. The Bell Inn? I wonder if it's real gold, Zachy. Can we weigh him in? Yeah. Thomas Payne, 1809. He stands out a mile away, doesn't he? Does 17, 1737 to 1809. Mm. A bit of a memorial to some yeah. of the squadrons like of Thetford and East Retham. Yeah. And then literally just a bit to the town centre here. It's gone red is all of a sudden. We've gone from cold yeah. to redders in 30 seconds. I know. Mm. Oh, well. Oh, you're lovely and warm in that sun. <laughs> that little arch with a housey thing on top. Cheer. St. Cuthbert's. St. Cuthbert's Church. Oh, and I can see a pub. There's a pub there, look, and it's a Witherspoons pub, and it's got outdoor seating at the front. Oh, hey. Well, it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? <laughs> the Red Lion. I think that's a cheeky pint, right? Mm -hmm. You're old enough now. <laughs> Early 14. Get your first Bud Light. <laughs> it's glorious now, isn't it? So we've had to stop and have a cheeky beer. It's middle of March and we're sat outside a pub and I'm in a t-shirt. We're only having Bud Light though for anybody who's concerned. Yeah. Because they're £2.39 a pint and we're yeah. tight wads. 
is actually having his favourite Pepsi Max. Yeah. But yeah, sun's come out. It's lovely. It's then. lovely. It's a little sun trap sat here, isn't it? It is a little flowers look. Sun trap sat here. Very yeah. nice. Little white pansies, aren't they? Yeah. Well, not little, not so little pansies. They're quite lots big of pansies. ladybirds on there as well. Look, um, some bees on there as well. Yeah, well, Sun's gone in now, but Zach's got an ice cream. <laughs> mm. Nice. It looks nice ice cream, though. Oh, jumper's gone back on. Jumper's come back out. <laughs> it, it has gone a bit fresh. It, it has, and there's a big black cloud there, so the sun's not going to be back out. I was out just for a contemplating bit. taking my jumper off. Yeah, when it went in. And I could see it cloud, and it was like, I'll just hang on a minute. <laughs> we're refreshed now, so we're going to. Have a look down where the Dad's Army Museum is, it's down here somewhere. Mm. Painting on the wall, look. Yeah. A bit. I'm sure what this building is here. Mm. Unfortunately, it's closed today, the Dad's Army Museum. I think it's down here, maybe. Somewhere. We're going to have a quick nosy anyway. So, this is the building somewhere. It must be around the other end. Yeah, it's got the paintings up. Couple Jones, Captain Mainwaring, or Captain Mannering, Private Fraser. Yeah, it's here. Look. Yeah, so is the Dad's Army Museum. Shame it's shut today. Isn't it? Let's see if we can see which days it opens. I know it says it's on the Saturday. Every Saturday. And then Sundays. Yeah, so it's just Saturdays or Sundays. Yeah. Dogs welcome as well. It's a shame, isn't it? We're not it here is. by Saturday. I know, it is a shame. We've got toilets here as well, look if you need toilet. Yeah. Right, we'll go back up onto that road there and down that road and have a look at the castle grounds next. Oh, no. That's our next port of call. Yeah, but I can around here, man, until we find a parking space. <laughs> Pike Lane Parking. I think that was a private park. Oh, look at that doggy on the It's like Lassie. Oh, we've, uh, we've probably walked past all the key areas where they did the filming, but we're not quite sure. I don't recognise any of it, do you? No. There's a butchers, isn't there? What if the butchers is here? Possibly. Watch where you're walking. The old yeah. clock shop here. Oh. I think a lot of the shops have gone now, aren't they? Yeah, it's a shame, isn't it? It is, but... I suppose there's no demand it's for it now. It's an old building, look, bless it. It's like an old uh, farm barn, isn't it? Something school. The Damara School. Hmm. Could hear a pin drop round here. If it walked up buggy wheels. Yeah, if it went up a big buggy wheels. It's probably one of the quietest places we've been to, isn't it? It's like, mm. so, so quiet. I'm not sure if we can get into it there. Castle grounds is behind here. Doesn't look a very good walkway through there, but it does look like there's a walkway around the end. Alright, oh, okay. Well, there's the mound, look. So we can't get through there, we just have to take go out and lift the buggy over. We'll walk round because it comes back down it, oh. just up here somewhere. We found a cut through, and it looks like you can get on top of the mound up there. So, Boo's going to go off-road. Are you the ready? Bobby's going to go off-road. Uh, ready, go! Ready for another little run. So this is the way we're heading. Castle Hill. Thetford Castle Mound is the tallest medieval earthworks in Britain. This is the tallest ones in Britain. Mm. Well, it looks like it would have had a... Like a castle on top of it. Tiny, tiny castle building <coughs> on the top. Yeah. And then it'll just be surrounded. Up on top of there. Ooh. Now, I thought we were going to go up there. It's like the moat's yeah. only on one side. Oh, so it was like one big area, but yes. the, the castle was just on top well, of that. Yeah. The river's there, isn't it, protecting it, and then that moat. Let, let's go and have a closer it's inspection. It's like a big area, but it's just that the castle was only there. Right, like a protected on top of that. village because it shows there's like village bu buildings inside of the moat. There is quite a few steps to that. 
But me and Zach are going to go up, aren't we, Zach? Uh, yeah. And oh, I'll go up, and then you and Catherine go up. I'll have to boo. He ain't going to go up there, is he? No, I doubt he's going to make it up there, and there's no way I'm carrying him. No. No, he, too heavy. He's not interested in looking up there, is he? Wow, that's a lot of steps. I'm going to go up on my own, and Zach's going to go up with Catherine in a minute. Oh, like uh, a composite. You get a good view up here. Wow, the steps are killers. That's obviously where the castle was. In the middle there. Oh, I'm not that fit anymore. But yeah, catching view. Catherine and Zach are waiting down there. It's their turn next. <sighs> and then the van is uh, somewhere over that way, somewhere we can walk back down this way. It's a good thing about having Google Maps these days. Catherine and Zach are up there now, look at the top of the steps. Having their turn. Them steps are a little bit of a killer. You can hear the jets in the distance from, uh, I presume from Mario uh, Lake and Eve, is it? No, well, there's a couple of bases around here, but not seen any over here yet. What are you doing, fidget bum? Who's fidgeting because you don't know where they've gone? You can't go up there, it's too far, kill your little legs up there. Well, I don't know about you, but my legs are aching there. Yeah, <laughs> We're just a bit unfit for stuff like that. You see that lass in front of me with dog? She ran up there. Man, she did sit down at top for ages. Yeah, I, I bet she did. But yeah. Oh, I've just got a lot of calf strength. I'm feeling it now being sat down. <laughs> you, you, can feel, you can feel it in your calves, can't you? Yeah. yeah, I can feel it all over, to be fair. <laughs> I can just feel it here in my calf. Yeah. Yeah, I can feel it down there and all. Not used to doing 100 plus steps at a time, though, are we? Was that how many way? Count them? I didn't count them, no, but there's been more than 100. Possibly about a hundred. Two hundred, I would say about a hundred steps. Yeah, fair few. Mhm. Mm well. So we need to go down here, along there, and then the road goes down. And in my opinion, they were quite big gaps between. They each were step. quite good sized steps, weren't they? On way down, yeah. You like if you went slow, you'd have to go two feet on each step. Yeah. But it's only a, a short walk back down to the van now. All right. I think mm. it's actually forecast rain tomorrow. Oh, that's a shame. Well, I know, but... What can you do? Not a lot. There's not a lot of people. Oh, going down, Elsa. Oh, my legs. Oh. <laughs> my legs. That's it. We're retiring to the van now. Yeah. Um, for for a brew. For a brew. For a brew. For a brew. Yeah, it's need a jumper now. Although, there's no breeze here, so there it's... Isn't. It's nice and... Uh, just a nice temperature. Well, there is actually another river because I've just spotted it on Google Maps. The River Thet is at the top side of the other river. So maybe that's why there's two that go into one. Which way do we go here? Uh, oh, Nuns Bridge down that way. Down that way. Nuns Bridge way. I reckon it's looking a bit like rain up there now. It's it does gone a, bit, a bit, to be fair. A bit grey. It says BTO. What does BTO mean? No idea. Birds. Birds too often. <laughs> birds too often. Zach's got it. BTO is birds too often <laughs> at Nunsbridge. <sighs> I'm absolutely shattered today. Well, we've been out for about three hours, so uh, we've done a bit of walking. You don't realise when you're stopping and looking at things, filming, how far you actually go. Catherine will have to have a look, see how many steps we've done, eh, Zach? Oh, he's watching videos, he hasn't had his phone. <laughs> watching some videos. I'll be in a I'm peckish now before tea. We've been out three hours nearly. Have we? Yeah. Huh. You've seen all goose gathering over there, look. I'm absolutely cream cracker. That's obviously what they're little green. It's bedtime over there yeah. for a minute, isn't it? <laughs> I missed them. There's a couple of jets just come around there. When you were stood on top of the castle mound, you could see where they were going down. Me and Zach were stood watching two of them. Yeah, I think they're from uh, RF Lake and East. Mm. Wherever that is, we, I don't, I'm not sure which what it's direction. over that so way. I think it's over that way, yeah. Because you stood at the castle mound there and we were looking that way. 
Oh dear, everything's fell out of the cupboard. The joys. That's when I do anything. No, you never go in the cupboard. Oh, you the, cheeky sod. I do all the cooking in this van. You cheeky devil. Oh. Oh, did you trap the film, oh dear? No. <laughs> so I'm going to make a bit of tea. I've, guess what I've got for tea? Got this from, uh, was it Morrison's? Yeah. Morrison's. Yeah. Donna kebab in a bag. It's that microwave stuff, I think. I think the microwave it. Oh, you can pan fry, air fry, air, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I just do it in Ridge Monkey. Done it in Ridge Monkey before. Not that particular one. I normally I get the one from Iceland. I've got no hot chilli sauce, but I've got some sweet chilli sauce. I've got some more of these salt and fries. And Zach's going to have chicken burger and fries. And Catherine's going to have a pot noodle. I'm not that hungry. Pot noodle? I know. Uh, they're oh. all my favourite ones. No one ever sells them. And I just found some the other day when we were in that Morrison's. And they've not got many left, so I'll have a couple. But the first problem is, is I've got to get back up onto my legs. <laughs> <laughs> we're going a bit down now. We're leaning. Leaning really bad. That way. Yeah. But we don't want to get levelling blocks out here, plus we'd stick out a bit too far, so... Yeah. We'll make do. It'll be for one night. It'll be alright on the night. And that's what Catherine's having. Her favourite pot noodle. Sweet and sour. I'm not bothered about it at the minute, I'll get it in a bit. Just do okay. your two's teas. Cheap night for me then. Kebab meat and chips. And... Zachy can have his chicken burger and chips. Dinner is served for me and Zach. There you go, mate. Chicken burger and chip of Thank you. Didn't have any chicken bun, any bread buns. We do. We don't. Mum bought an entire load of them yesterday. They're all gone. We didn't have eight burgers in one night. And uh, we've got plenty of done and eat. A bit more than I anticipated there, to be honest, but that's my tea. Plenty of jets taking off, isn't there? It's, yeah. all you can, it's all you can hear. And, uh, oh, look at that. The sun's made a circle in the above. Look at that. Doesn't that look pretty? It's like a halo it's out like there. It's like a halo, and then it's lighting up all the separate I'd clouds. show you on the GoPro, but it would not do it justice. No, it wouldn't. But yeah, oh, the, that's beautiful. It is. It's RAF Lake, and if we can hear the jets from, um, there's F-35s and F-15s fly from there. Mm. Um, I'm not sure. They look like F-35s, but I can't really tell. They're a bit far in the distance, but... Um, Lovely guy next door, Richard. Hello, Richard. Hi, Richard. Just come and spoke to us. Um, yeah, he's, there's a viewing area up there, so I've just found it on Google Maps. Mm. It's literally nine mile away, so I think tomorrow we'll we might go have and to uh, go up and have a look, won't we? We've got a top gun. <laughs> yeah, we'll go and have a little yeah. hour there or something. Why not? Watch a few of the uh, noisy jets take off, yeah? Mm. Rumble the van. Not bother. You see, uh, some people's dogs don't like the loud noises, but. You don't even notice. <laughs> He didn't notice anything. <laughs> he doesn't. Well, so, he's slightly deaf, isn't he? Sorry. Yeah, well, I don't know. I think he's, he just doesn't bother, does he? Yeah. He's not interested. Yeah. We want to thank uh, Julie for sending us the PayPal donation as well. Yes, thank, thank you very much, Julie. Very kind. Thank you, Julie. And hope you're enjoying mm -hmm. Benidorm. There's a big kiss for you. Oh, yes, <laughs> Benidorm. I hope you're having a one euro glass of wine. Yeah, absolutely. Or a one euro pint. Not to be missed, are they, them? Yeah, so... Um, Rich and his friend, uh, full timers, they've stopped here, they stop in different places around mm -hmm. here. So we know it's good. Catherine's just yeah. been out watching the deers. I know, there's loads Monk of jacks. little baby deers around. <coughs> uh, yeah. I've not beautiful. managed to capture any on the GoPro. Um we've caught them on us phones yeah. but a bit distant, so yeah. But yeah, lots of little monk jacks running about. That's it. And we've got another quick get well to do as well to Big Bob, Bob yes. Southcoat. Get well, um, Bob. Diane's written in and just told us that you're not doing very well at the minute. So, yeah, so hope you all get, the best from hope us. You're on the mend or yeah, get well, hope Bob. you're on the mend soon. Yeah, so um, sun's going down now. It is. Well, I've it left is. the roof fence open. I've got the heating on as well. <coughs> and the door open. <laughs> and the door open. Well, we're talking to Richard. Yeah. But yeah, we've got the uh, we're gonna have the gas heating on tonight just to rather than not ever have it on, just mm. keep putting it on now and again. To keep the system working because yeah. I think if we He's leave it off, to find room for his tap hook. They're all blooming window behind us now. It's not as well set here as well. Look, you want to see it in the toilet? 
It's like doing it in the wild. Oh dear. We need to brighten the van up. It's it's too much wood in here. Then we need colour, darling. We need we need to wrap the cupboards. Is what we need to do. Mm. We need some, some colour. Vinyl wrap on. If we did the cupboard doors, mm -hmm. the fridge doors, mm -hmm. um, just the cupboard doors, the fridge doors. I reckon it would look pretty good. Yeah, it just lighten it up a bit, won't it? In uh, like a similar colour to the the chairs, mm. like a, a cream rather than a white. We're gonna have to buy some and get on it. Yeah, I think so. <coughs> I think it's fairly straightforward. Just stick it on, don't you? You've got to, it's a bit like wallpapering, isn't it? Because you've got to get the air bubbles out. And... No problem, no problem. <laughs> but yeah, if you want to see the Fast Jets RF Lake in here, you'll have to tune in next time because mm. we're ending this video here. The sun's now decided it's going to blind me through the window. The sun's blinding me through the window. <laughs> so we're going to thank you all for watching. And as always, we will see you in the next one. See you in the next one.